In recent days, the Vice President of the European Parliament, along with 14 members of the European Parliament, have addressed a joint letter to the President of the European Commission and the High Representative of the European Commission on the grim human rights situation in the occupied Jammu and Kashmir. Significantly, these 14 members of the European Parliament represent different political groups within the EU Parliament. In their letter, the MEPs have raised important points, including Kashmir has become one of the world's most militarized zones and a tremendously dangerous conflict flashpoint. The freedom and fundamental rights of the people of Jammu and Kashmir have been suppressed for the past seven decades. India has imposed a de facto nine month long military lockdown and imposed a stifling curfew, shut down telecommunications and internet and arrested political leaders. The European members of parliament have called for a stop to exploiting and fomenting ethnic and religious tensions and to give Kashmiri people the hope and a chance at self-determination. 